work with each day, consider Japan is like Poland, Philippines is like Romania, China is like Russia, Taiwan is Ukraine. That's where Jap Japan sees their role to help prevent a conflict and defend their country. The greater threat to Japan's sovereignty is the People's Republic of China, particularly the People's Liberation Army. China's emergence as Japan's most formidable adversary since World War II has prompted an unprecedented response from the Japanese military. With a record-breaking $56 billion earmarked for defense expenditure in 2024, and ambitious plans to ramp it up to $300 billion by 2027, Japan is poised to usher in a new era of military prowess and technological innovation. This substantial investment is driving the development and acquisition of cutting-edge weaponry, intended to reshape the balance of power in the Asia-Pacific region and safeguard Japan's national interests. Submarines. Japan's submarine fleet is undergoing a significant transformation with an emphasis on equipping current and future vessels with advanced long-range cruise missiles. These missiles, capable of deployment from vertical launch systems and torpedo tubes, are set to replace the existing harpoon missiles procured from the United States. Plans are underway to develop a new missile platform, potentially derived from the proven Type 12 subsonic anti-ship missile, renowned for its reliability and effectiveness in naval engagements. Aircraft carriers. In a historic departure from its post, World War II pacifist stance, Japan is embarking on the construction of a new class of aircraft carriers known as the Izumo class. Originally designed as helicopter carrying destroyers, these vessels are undergoing extensive upgrades to accommodate fixed wing aircraft, notably the F 35 B Lightning II. This strategic initiative underscores Japan's commitment to enhancing its maritime capabilities and projecting power in contested waters. Next generation fighter. Japan's collaborative effort with Britain and Italy to develop a sixth generation air superiority fighter represents a quantum leap in aerial combat capabilities. Equipped with revolutionary technologies such as electric actuators and advanced stealth features, this next-generation fighter promises unmatched agility, lethality, and survivability in future conflicts. With a significant portion of the defense budget allocated to this program, Japan aims to maintain air superiority in contested airspace. Aegis system-equipped vessels. Japan's focus on missile defense is exemplified by the acquisition of Aegis system-equipped vessels, designed to enhance its ballistic missile defense capabilities. These formidable warships, equipped with cutting-edge sensor suites and interceptors, will play a critical role in detecting and neutralizing incoming threats, thereby bolstering Japan's overall defense posture in an increasingly uncertain security environment. Missiles. Central to Japan's defense strategy, is the deployment of advanced standoff missiles to deter and counter potential adversaries, particularly China. Investments totaling $5.15 billion are allocated for the procurement of locally made Type 12 cruise missiles, alongside American-made Tomahawk and SM-3 missiles, further augmenting Japan's offensive and defensive capabilities. Furthermore, Japan's ongoing efforts to develop hypersonic missiles underscore its commitment to maintaining a technological edge in missile technology, ensuring its ability to respond swiftly and decisively to emerging threats. Continuing the discussion on Japan's military modernization efforts, it's evident that the nation is strategically positioning itself to address a range of security challenges particularly in light of China's assertive behavior in the East China Sea and South China Sea. Japan's investment in submarines, aircraft carriers, next-generation fighters, missile defense systems, and advanced missiles underscores its commitment to maintaining a credible deterrent and enhancing its ability to respond decisively to any contingency. Regional Security Dynamics Japan's military buildup reflects broader geopolitical shifts in the Indo-Pacific region, characterized by intensifying competition among major powers and growing concerns over maritime security. With China's rapid military expansion and assertive behavior, 
Japan faces a complex security environment that necessitates robust defense capabilities and close strategic partnerships with like-minded nations. Technological innovation. A key driver of Japan's military modernization is its emphasis on technological innovation and indigenous defense production capabilities. By investing in research and development, Japan aims to reduce its dependence on foreign suppliers and strengthen its defense industrial base. Collaborative ventures with allied countries further enhance Japan's access to cutting-edge technologies and facilitate the sharing of expertise in areas such as cybersecurity, space defense, and artificial intelligence. Strategic Partnerships Japan's defense modernization efforts are closely aligned with its broader security cooperation initiatives, notably the Quadrilateral Security Dialogue, Quad, comprising Japan, the United States, Australia, and India. Through multilateral forums and bilateral defense agreements, Japan seeks to deepen military interoperability, intelligence sharing, and joint exercises to effectively counter common security threats including maritime piracy, terrorism, and proliferation of weapons of mass destruction. Constitutional reinterpretation. Japan's military modernization is occurring within the framework of its pacifist constitution, which renounces war as a sovereign right and prohibits the maintenance of offensive military capabilities. However, successive Japanese governments have adopted a more assertive interpretation of the constitution, allowing for the expansion of the country's self-defense forces and participation in collective security arrangements with allies. Regional stability. Despite Japan's efforts to bolster its defense capabilities, Tokyo remains committed to a peaceful and diplomatic resolution of territorial disputes and security challenges in the region. Japan's defense posture is defensive in nature, aimed at deterring aggression and safeguarding the rules-based international order. By promoting dialogue, confidence-building measures, and crisis management mechanisms, Japan seeks to mitigate the risk of miscalculation and escalation in regional hotspots. Global Responsibilities Beyond its immediate neighborhood, Japan is increasingly assuming greater security responsibilities on the global stage, including peacekeeping operations, humanitarian assistance, and disaster relief efforts. As a major contributor to international security, Japan plays a vital role in maintaining stability and upholding norms of responsible behavior in cyberspace, outer space, and other emerging domains of warfare. As Japan progresses with its military modernization agenda, it is imperative to consider the broader implications of these efforts on regional dynamics and international security architecture. Japan's enhanced defense capabilities could potentially contribute to greater deterrence against aggression, thereby fostering stability and peace in the Indo-Pacific region. However, the militarization of Japan's security posture also raises concerns among neighboring countries particularly China and South Korea, which harbor historical grievances and territorial disputes with Japan. Furthermore, Japan's evolving defense posture has implications for its alliance relationships, particularly with the United States. While the US-Japan alliance remains the cornerstone of Japan's security strategy, Tokyo's efforts to bolster its independent defense capabilities could lead to a more equitable distribution of security burdens within the alliance framework. This trend is evidenced by Japan's increased defense spending, acquisition of advanced military hardware, and participation in joint military exercises with the United States and other allies. At the same time, Japan's military modernization raises questions about the future trajectory of its security policy, including the possibility of revising its pacifist constitution to accommodate a more proactive role in regional security affairs. The prospect of Japan acquiring offensive capabilities or engaging in preemptive military actions could unsettle regional stability and trigger arms races among neighboring countries, exacerbating existing security dilemmas. Moreover, Japan's military modernization efforts intersect with broader geopolitical trends, such as the intensifying strategic competition between the United States and China. 
As both countries vie for influence and dominance in the Indo-Pacific, Japan finds itself navigating a delicate balancing act between its security alliance with the United States and its economic interdependence with China. Japan's defense policy must therefore be calibrated to maintain a delicate equilibrium between its security imperatives and its economic interests. In addition to traditional security challenges, Japan must also contend with emerging non-traditional threats, including cyber attacks, terrorism, and transnational organized crime. As cyberspace becomes increasingly contested and militarized, Japan's cyber defense capabilities will play a critical role in protecting its national security interests and critical infrastructure from malicious actors. Furthermore, Japan's commitment to multilateralism and international cooperation is reflected in its active participation in regional security forums, such as the ASEAN Regional Forum, ARF, and the East Asia Summit, EAS. By promoting dialogue, confidence-building measures, and cooperative security initiatives, Japan seeks to build trust and enhance cooperation among regional stakeholders, thereby reducing the risk of conflict and instability. In conclusion, Japan's military modernization efforts are driven by a complex interplay of strategic, technological, and geopolitical factors. While Japan's pursuit of a more robust defense posture is understandable given its evolving security environment, it is essential for Tokyo to proceed with caution and transparency to avoid exacerbating regional tensions and undermining the prospects for peace and stability in the Indo-Pacific.